We are hearing from someone who stopped to help when that camper caught fire on I-40 the other day. Remember that? We've shown you these videos. That camper went up in flames Wednesday afternoon on I-40 right under Pellissippi Parkway. It was scary stuff. Turns out that fire was not the only emergency. But an off-duty UT police officer and a nurse, they just happened to be there. WATE 6 on your side reporter Kirsty Crawford talked with one of those heroes about what happened on the highway. Summer Corporal Kyle Bochica says he just happened to be in the right place at the right time. And because of his training, he knew what to do for both of the emergencies he faced. Bochica was running errands when he saw smoke up ahead on I-40. As he got closer to the scene, he realized first responders weren't there yet. Bochica says other bystanders were already working to get the driver and the truck away from the burning camper. He jumped in to help too. Once the truck was free from the camper, another emergency happened. One of the bystanders collapsed. Officials tell us he had a heart attack. Botica says he and a nurse did CPR until medics arrived, saving his life. He was there to help people that he didn't know. And he obviously put himself in legitimate harm's way to do so. And it's always encouraging to see that random people who don't have the training that I have and don't have that built up response where they just kind of automatically go um, to see them doing that too is just really encouraging. Bochica says he keeps thinking about the what ifs. What if he and that nurse hadn't been there when the man collapsed? That's why he says everyone should learn how to do CPR. Summer. Wow, Kirstie, thank you. What a story. Corporal Botica says he has gotten in touch with the man he saved and his family. He has no idea who that nurse was or any of the other bystanders, but he does want to thank them as well for putting their lives at risk for a complete stranger.